this is Scout and today we're making a Norwal paper bag puppet. So what you're going to need is a small brown paper bag, a glue stick, a pencil and a black texture and of course our Norwal template which you can find on our website for free. So let's get started. First thing we're going to do is grab our Norwell body piece which looks a bit like this. We're going to flip it over and we're going to glue the entire back of our body piece. So grab our glue stick and glue 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 gluing, glue, 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 gluing, we're gluing the body piece and once you've done that we'll grab the body piece and we're going to match up the bottom of the body piece to the bottom of our paper bag just like this. So there we go, sliding it under the fold and once you've got it in position then we push down to make sure it sticks. Just like that. So it should look a bit like this so far. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab this head piece. So our head piece looks a bit like this. And what we're going to do is we're going to grab our paper bag part and we're just going to glue the entire part of the base of our paper bag, okay? So just like this. Glue, 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 gluing. Glue, 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 gluing. So once we've done that, we'll grab that headpiece and we're going to line up the bottom of our head with the bottom of the fold. Just like this. And push it down to make sure it sticks nice. Hmm. So your Norwell should be looking a bit like this so far. So we've got our head and our body done. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab our Norwell's tail. <laughs> so what we're going to do with this is we're going to glue along the straight line of our Norwell's tail. Just like that. <laughs> Once we've done that, we're going to flip over our paper bag and we're going to attach our tail onto the back just like that <laughs> so that's what your Norwell should look like from the front so far did you know that Norwells live in the Arctic so they live in the Arctic waters up near Greenland and Canada and Russia, one of the best divers of marine mammals and they can dive up to 1,800 meters deep. That's a lot. <laughs> the next thing we're going to do is grab these little cute little fins, cute little fins, <laughs> and we're going to place them on the front like that just like that. So we're going to flip them over and we're just going to put a bit of glue on one point of each of our flippers, making sure they are the opposite points. So this point, if you put them close together, if they match, it'll help you be able to figure out which one is the opposite. And once you've done that, going to flip it over and put it onto our paper bag. 
like this. One and two. Okay, so from the front, our Norwell looks like this. So he's got his great big tail and his little flippers to be able to dive nice and deep. Hmm. I think our Norwell needs something to see with. That's right, he needs some eyes. So let's grab our eye pieces. Ooh. And we're going to glue on the back of the eyepiece. One eye, we'll stick it on one side of his head and let's do the other eye. Glue, 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 glue and we'll stick it on the other side of his head just like that. <laughs> now I think our Norwell needs a cute little smile, don't you? So we're going to grab our pencil and we're just going to draw a little smile in the middle of his face under the eyes, just like that. Once you're happy with your smile, we'll grab our black texture and we'll go over that in black. Just like that. Our happy little Norwell. Mm -hmm. Finally, what is missing on our Norwell? What makes a Norwell so special? That's right, his horn. It's a bit like a unicorn horn. So let's grab our Norwell's horn and we're going to put a little bit of glue at the base of our Norwell's horn on the back side. So there you go, glue it on. Once we've done that, we're going to stick it in the center of his head at the top, just like so. <laughs> There's our little Norwell's. <laughs> Did you know that the horn is actually a tusk and it's not used for fighting like they used to think. It's actually used so they can sense the changes of their environment. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what I should call my Norwell. Hmm. Do you think he is a Nathan? Or do you think it's a Nikki? What do you think? I'm going to go with Nikki. I'm Nikki the Norwell. I can deep dive really deep. Up to 1,800 meters. Oh, that's impressive. <laughs> How did yours turn out? Good job today, guys. You did really well, and I'm so happy that you got to make your own Norwell paper bag puppet with me. I hope you enjoyed it. I know Scout's a bit tuckered out, so I'll have to say goodbye now. So I'll see you next time. Bye.